ago, after my daughter was born, I had gained a lot of weight. I was a rugby player down in Detroit, and I couldn't go back to rugby because that meant driving to Detroit multiple times a week, so it didn't work. And I have always had that kind of um, aggressive outlet sport. So a friend of mine introduced me to just boxing. I used that to get in shape enough to come get in shape. And I <laughs> came here and have been hooked ever since. Be fierce. I put this on a while ago. It was a reminder to myself that to be authentic, to be myself, be true to who I am, and be fierce because that's just who I am. And it's easy to slip into this mode of um, not being true to yourself. And this sport has allowed me to do that by getting out some of those extra energy aggressions, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. One of the other things that I love about this sport is that it has a lot of women's empowerment. And what is awesome to me is that it gives me strength, um, both mentally and physically. I know that I can protect myself. It's a self-defense, but okay. generally it's I'm pushing myself and competing against myself to be better than myself each day and work hard each day. And that it's so empowering. It's the same in work, it's the same at play, um, and this place really brings it all together. So in traditional Muay Thai, it's the art of eight limbs, and it is um, steeped in history. Uh, I have a level three certification, which means I'm certified to instruct. And part of the testing is not just the technique, but it's knowing the history and how it was founded. This is not a sport that is um, was originally made for cage fighting. It was made for the kings and queens, and it was made for um, the people of Thailand, and, and it's a symbol to them. They have a dance called the Y Crew, which is them honoring their god, their teacher, their crew, and honoring all of those that have gotten them where they're at. And it's, it's a beautiful dance. It's done different through every class, but it's just or out of every gym, but it's, it's history. It's not about getting into the cage and fighting. 